Hey, Novelineal here, uh, doing some test plays today. Uh, so I'm going to be running your map here above below. Uh, just going to check the Discord. Uh, so yeah, it just kind of looks like you're looking for feel the patterns and how are the difficulty spikes and bursts and stuff. Uh, so I will let you know because yeah, I can get overwhelmed by bursts and if they happen like only once in a map, that usually makes the map not super fun for me because then I can't full combo it. Um, Otherwise, I, I don't think Map Checker had too much to point out. Like, there's a couple double directionals. It, it flagged a lot of stacked bombs. So if you haven't checked check your bombs, check those. Um, and the numbers... That note jump speed is kind of low. I'm worried the map's going to be cluttered at uh, five notes per second. But I'll try it with your numbers. And if it's, if it's really weird, then I might have to take it back. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and start now. Uh, but otherwise, we'll just kind of go and actually let's take a step back. Oh, I think that was a uh, reset on blue. Uh, that was a really long time kind of hanging out over on the left. In fact, I'm still kind of over there. Whoops. Something, something felt weird there. Let me... Uh, 103. Something felt weird there. Here. I think something felt weird with that red note, maybe? I think was... Is that a reset? Uh, that might have been a reset on red. I didn't really have, uh... I don't, I don't remember what the note was before. Might have been a reset on red, or maybe I just messed up the notes. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I think that's the burst you were talking about. Yeah. I... Hmm. Uh, yeah, so playing that, there's a couple of issues I have with that, which to be fair, take with a grain of salt, some of is just me. Um, first of all, inline notes that fast are quite a bit more challenging to read. At this note jump speed, I don't think that's going to matter. It does kind of, again, look a little bit cluttered. Um, and again, a fast note, note jump speed might actually help with that. But the bigger issue is, is you've kind... Okay, so this map has been very chill up until now. Like, there's a couple cool things here and there and stuff. Um, you know, patterns feel pretty good. So you're doing two things, though. Is one, you're doing bursts. Like, you've... you've Because I, I, I'd have to check in the, in the checker. It, like, say, hypothetically, the whole map has been... Um, every quarter note. I don't know if that's true, but we'll just say hypothetically. And now you're switching to every eight notes for these bursts. Okay, so that's fine. So that's an increase in basically hand speed of two. But now on top of that, you're also doing those um, bursts as single saber. And doing things as single saber also doubles the effective speed that your hands are moving, right? So if you have every quarter note, but you're doing it with one hand, that's very different than if you have every quarter note doing it two hands, right? Like kind of doing... A quarter note one hand is kind of the equivalent of doing, um, sorry, I'm losing my train of thought. Okay. If you do half notes with one hand, that's kind of the equivalent of doing quarter notes with two hands, right? So the thing is that you've increased the speed twofold because you've, again, hypothetically gone from quarters or from halves to quarter notes, then that doubles the speed. And then you've also increased it by uh, two again by making it single saber. 
And then on top of that, you have the other notes with the stacks with the opposite hand, which that's fine. I don't mind that for emphasis. But the problem is those are really slow. Like I want to say those are every beat maybe. So now I have to increase my hand that's doing the, um, the bursts times four. And I'm basically slowing down the other hand to maybe half because I think you've been doing sort of a consistency of every half note ish. So now if I'm having to do big swings on the one beat, it's basically like I've slowed this hand down by half and then increased this hand by four. It's really confusing. Um, maybe check, like I said, check the descriptions. I always say check the descriptions of the video because I might be able to give better feedback by um, looking at it in the editor and actually seeing what the numbers do. But I think if you want to have bursts here, you absolutely can, but I would pick one, right? Like I would do something like make the bursts alternate hands. So effectively you're only increasing the speed by two, but then still absolutely have the stacks there because you probably can't do doubles. It's going to be a gallop, but then absolutely have the stacks there for emphasis. And I think that's going to make it much more playable and much more on par with what the map, rest of the map is doing. Because again, if the whole map is, is things like bursts and single saber, you could probably get away with it. But yeah, this is a massive difficulty at Spike. I feel compared to the rest of the map. So I'm just good. Okay. Anyway, that's all I'll say about that. That's, uh, I think that might have been a reset on red. Okay, so that's enough about talking about that, though. Let's keep it going. Whoop, I think that was a reset on red. Uh, that was a little hard to read, but it was fine. That might have been a reset on blue. See, I'm, I'm, I'm botching this, but this, this feels like a better use of burst. Hang on a second. Let me go back. Uh, now, now the only problem is again, you have inline notes here, which I personally don't love. Well, it's, it's kind of better. Uh, uh, I think that was some vision blocks there. A uh, bunch of resets here. Uh, that reset felt a little awkward. You've got a lot of really cool uh, angles on your doubles. Yeah, see that's, that burst felt a lot better because it was alternating. Uh, that invert was a little hard to hit. That blew up top there. Let me just go back a sec. It, it was fine, but it was just... Uh, no, I like it. Never mind. Uh, I think some re resets or something weird with those four buttons were known. Even if they weren't technically resets. Was there a reset on blue there? There might have been a reset on blue in the middle of... I think there might have been two downs. Maybe not. Sorry, I'm... Uh, I think that might have been vision block with the blue stack there. little ending yeah i like that okay yeah lots of cool stuff there um couple things uh that i would do is i would definitely run it through the map checker to find the vision blocks or sorry not the vision blocks the double directionals um i do apologize it's kind of hard for me to conclusively pinpoint them when i'm playing because i might just be making a mistake but there was definitely a, what felt like a couple of resets that i think were not supposed to be there um uh so run it through the map checker i already forgot what i was gonna say Run through the map checker. Oh, um, I was going to say, yeah, you had a lot of really cool uh, doubles. So as long as they're not like resets and stuff, uh, I think those are really cool. I'd probably adjust the numbers um, 
take a look at the, uh, I, I mean, I can give you some suggestions, but you can also take a look at the um, Beat Saber Modding Group Wiki. Um, they give you some standard numbers for like expert plus difficulty that I think would help. And yeah, I, I don't know if the Wiki specifically will talk about streams, but what I will do is I will link you about uh, the hand speed section, uh, because I think that's really interesting. I tried to explain it as best as I could, uh, and I'll try to make some notes in the description, but like, I think it's fine having the burst there, but I think they need to be changed uh, so that they're not too much of a difficulty spike. Uh, so anyway, let me know if you have any questions. Uh, otherwise, I hope that helps.